somebody died, you at the funeral, you taking a picture of the person in the I saw that one time. Somebody took a picture. Somebody took a picture of the like at all. I remember um at one of my uncle's funerals, like my one of my cousins actually said, Hey bro, take a picture of me. Like like right by the cast. I'm like, why you wanna take a picture? Like why? Like yeah. people just do the like you said, people just do the most, people just want attention. But well, like I'm not And then that gets you the question, like, why are you crying? You why don't are you like crying? You just you they concerned. Pictures. You post exactly. the pictures. Exactly. Post exactly. The, the, the people the people who selfies at the funeral. Exactly. Right. <laughs> Taking pictures and stuff. You're supposed to be mourning. <laughs> my, I say, my, and the thing is, it's always the people that be hysterically crying that really just don't even know the person for real. Or they weren't there or when they needed them. Or they weren't even there when they needed them. Because, like, I, I say, yeah, a funeral is sad. Death is sad. But I feel it's easier. I, I feel it's easier to, um, if you know what's going on, funerals are sad, but it's easier to cope if you've been with that person. No, yeah. Going through the struggle with them. If you just hear and you all of a sudden you oh they died and oh okay uh I'm... so I got a question. Yeah. What would you what advice would you give to somebody who would like consider committing suicide because they lost a loved one? If I feel like if you have lost a loved one, if you are overstricken with that much grief.